They should have a little thing that like registers the sound that the net makes, like a noise meter. And depending on the crispness of that sound, more points. Like, oh, you know what it could be? It could be tied directly to decibels. So if it sounds whoosh, loud enough, you get that many decibels worth of points. Roy, you have a decent swish sound. Let's hear it. Nah, decent. Dude, how That's you got one? That's pretty good. No. All right, uh, 786-456-4837 if you want to call in with your uh, swish sound. Steven, you're on ESPN Radio. Do you make a good swish sound? Swish. Steven, go ahead. Oh, That sounds but, more like a paper cut. Nothing but nylon. Uh, Mike, you're on ESPN Radio. Go ahead, Mike. Ooh, well, let's wow. go on. Let's oh, go on. Well, I want to hear that again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to hear that again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to hear it again. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I lost him. He'll... I All right. Well, bring him back. I'm sorry. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah, I lost up. him. Will you calm down? We'll, we'll never know if it's calm him. Calm down. Everybody <laughs> calm down. James, no you're way. on ESPN Radio. James, go ahead, James. Oh, that that was like it? A bit like a pellet. Of... That was terrible. Oscar, you're on ESPN Radio. Go ahead, Oscar. Sounded like, sound a like a bat. forked bat. Yeah, yeah. Whitney, you're on ESPN Radio. Go. That sounds like Not a bad. sneeze. It sounded more like a sneeze. Gesundheit. Yeah. Nico, you're on ESPN Radio. Go ahead. <laughs> Guys, Bless you. <laughs> that is somebody sneezing <laughs> or choking. One or the other. Tyler, you're on ESPN Radio. Go ahead, Tyler. Oh. It'll never be what Matt was. You ruined no, it because you hung it. up on Matt, it, Matt last Matt. segment. Tyler, I'm just, I can't. Tyler just opened a beer. And his yeah. name was Mike. That's a fun. You have been distracted all show today handling your fantasy draft. You've also lashed out at everyone for your mistakes, and you owe money here. You haven't paid yet Wait, whatever it is that you were supposed to pay for your fine of blaming others. Right. You, you're you're just and you blamed Chris for the bad calls last segment. You also you blamed Chris for being a bad call screener. You spit that at at him. He's taking switch calls right. from all over That's America. Totally fair. And I, and Chris, how are you feeling about this batch of calls? Because I do believe that this was a decent idea that has died on the vine a little bit. You know, it's a decent idea. I feel okay about the calls. It's a little hard to judge because all I'm hearing for all I'm listening for is. So it's really tough to, you know, gauge what's a good one, what's a bad one. I didn't really know Mike a few segments back. I didn't know that was great, and that's the best switch down I've ever heard. Right. Got the name right this stuff. Yeah. Who have we decided has the best one here? Was Roy claiming that he has the best one? No, I never said that. <laughs> Here's mine. It's not terrible. His is not it terrible. Is terrible. It's not good. Go ahead, Amin. Oh, you got a great one. Let's hear yours, Amin. Yeah, two years. There was no net there. Let's hear it. You, you was like an air ball. Now it's on you. <laughs> Go ahead. It's on you. I have to burp. Hold on. Floors, really? Off the air. Didn't All I? right. Excellent work. By no, you. it is. It's it's like similar to Sugata. There's only certain days where you can whistle. You kind of need to make sure there's the right type of moisture in your mouth when you're going to make the swish sound. You want to hear it? Ready? Wow. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah. That's, that's just air. Yeah. There's got to be a... There's got to be a, a, a CH in there. All right. Here's mine. Oh, wow. Yeah. That was a heavy basketball. You know, it helps yeah. if I don't look at you guys when you do it. Can you do it again? Go. <laughs> Amazing. One more time. My turn. Oh, that's more of a whip. Yours is a horse and a chariot. Well, now he's like in that. my head, and I'm trying to do that sound at the end because he was right. At first, yeah. it was just the thing. All right, so 786-456-4837 is the telephone number. If you, no, man, no. it is raining jumpers. The Warriors just ran in here. A lot of four-pointers. <laughs> Josh, you're on ESPN Radio. Josh, go ahead. Oh, dear God. Oh, come on, come on yeah. Josh. Josh. Leave the jokes Whoa. to us, all right? Make, on, your, make, just make the swish sound. Cam, you're on ESPN Radio. Go. Solid. Was it? Solid. Try it again, Maybe Cam. let's talk duos. Do it, do, it, do it again, Cam. All right, that was a good one. That was a good one. Was good. it? It yeah, sounds like a golf good. ball falling into the hole. Uh, no. No, 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 no. That's more about. Mike, you're on ESPN Radio. Go ahead, Mike. Well, I don't have a net sound, but I do have a funny name for you. Oh, for crying out loud. You're not playing the game. You stopped that an hour ago. I mean. PTSD Gordon. Oh, okay. You see what I mean now about being a bad call screener? I mean, do you see? Do you see it? You? 
How about last you got it anyway? You know what? Here's you another know dollar. What? No, no. You know what, Stugatz? Please sit over there, Chris. Come sit oh, over I'm here. I'm going to chum it up. Let's yeah, go. Yeah. Let's see, let's see yeah. what Stugatz can do as a call screener here. I'm going to chum it up. What are you laughing about there, Roy? Hey, uh, who is this? <laughs> That's exactly what he said. Hey, uh, who is this? Get out of here, man. Right. It's got to be better than that. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Now, see, that is something Stu God's will say. I love you too, but you, you got to come stronger than that, man. Listen, this ain't Chris answering the phones anymore, all right? This is Stu God's answering the phones. I've been doing this for years. I was born to do this. Um, all right, you get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, he's just he's the, slow, he's the slowest call screener ever. Hey, who is this? Okay, Stu God's, I got to get a call who? on the air here. <laughs> who, Fran? <laughs> I got to get a call on the air here, Stugatz, at some point. Listen, uh, do you want the calls to be good, Dano, or do you want yes. them to be bad? All right. I mean, I that's will what wait call you screening's out. all about. All right. I will wait you out. We've got Who two minutes this? left in the segment. Get, oh, you guys get him out of my ears. These I can't, headphones, good I, God. I know, they're very loud. The headphones are very loud. So we're going to take these calls in a second from Stugatz. But what I'm telling you guys here in the audience, how do you think, Stugatz generally goes over at ESPN, given that much like with this call screening experiment, he thinks he could do every job in the building better than the people doing that job in the building. How do you guys imagine that that flies up in Bristol? Do you have any calls here that are worth going to? Uh, I do. The call. Listen, I realize how difficult the job is, okay? But you really have to press these people and make them do it again and again. And you got to take your time with this stuff. You can't just put them on the air. And that's what I, I'm talking. I'm yucking it up. We're having a blast here. I think I have four good calls on the line. And I think the one you're going to like the most, so save the best for last, is L, okay? Save the best is L. Mike, you're on ESPN Radio. What do you have, Mike? Do it again. Tell you screen a call, Dano. <laughs> I don't see uproarious laughter or approval in the other room. Josh, you're on ESPN Radio. Josh, go ahead. Whoa! Save him. What you got? Save him. What you got? Save him. What you got? Save him. Save him. All right, Whoa. you stay there. We're gonna have a. All right, we're gonna have uh, we're gonna have a, a swish off in a second. Josh, let's see if we can find another person to rival Josh so we end the show and we declare a winner once and for all. Fred, you're on ESPN Radio. Fred, go ahead. Back Aikman. All right, we got different games being played here. And he lost that game. Okay, here it is. The promised uh, call screening of Stugatz has resulted in L. L, you're on ESPN Radio. Go ahead, L. <laughs> Matt, uh, Stugatz did a great job screening this call, by the way. I love to show you guys. Um, I have a real important sports question here. L, uh, what I'm are you doing? L, what are you doing? You were a screened call who was calling in here with a swish sound, and now you're talking <laughs> to us. Where's your swish sound? Stay with L, Dan. He's got a very important question. All right, fine. I'll stay with L. Hey, first time calling you guys. I don't know what a swish sound is. I'm a real sports fan over here. Okay, so I got a real sports question for you guys. Um, should I spend money and go into a real state of the art ballpark in Oracle Park and watch the Giants play, or should I spend money and go sit in the sun and the heat at Levi's and watch the 49ers play? The real important sports question for you guys. Wow, I gotta put it on the poll. I mean, Stugatz, go walk into the ocean. Whoa! Like, what are you doing? What are you doing? What? Why did you put that person on the phone with me? Like, wh that's not what he said to me on the phone. I mean, I gotta be honest with you, man. <laughs> he totally duped me. I've still got Josh here waiting to do a swish off for with somebody. Apparently, apparently, shoeless Joe Jackson got blisters while wearing a new pair of cleats. So before his next at bat, he took the shoes off. And somebody said to him, you shoeless son of a gun, you. And the nickname stuck. <laughs> That's not what they said. That is exactly That's what been said. edited for content. Are you guys going to help me? Is anyone here going to help me with a call? Or no. Or is just everyone bouncing into each other, pinballing into each other, not doing what they're supposed to do? Dude, I just yelled at someone, put that on hold. And yeah, walked I mean, away from the phone. What's so easy is it, Stugatz? I lost. No, it's easy if you actually talk to them, take your time, and listen to what it is they're doing, and then and then get them got it. Go quickly to Mike. Mike, you're on ESPN Radio. Go ahead, Mike. <laughs> I mean, Christ almighty, Stugatz. Yeah, I'm going one. to throw you into the ocean myself.